Hi, I'm Mr. Wu Mingyo. Okay, um, let's talk about the energy work and power. Okay, energy is defined as the capacity to do work and in O-level, we are only concerned with the calculations of two kinds of energy and that is kinetic energy and gravitational potential energy. Okay, kinetic energy is energy that is associated with motion. That is why uh, during the calculation, velocity plays a part. Okay, um, Kinetic energy is calculated in terms of uh, joules and uh, is equal to half mv square with the mass being input as kg and the uh, velocity should be in terms of meter per second. Okay, um, gravitational potential energy is energy uh, that is associated with height Okay, and the unit is also joules and is equal to mgh and the mass is in terms of kg the gravitational field strength is either in terms of newton per kg or meter per second square and the height the height is in terms of meter okay next we move on to work okay work done is defined as the product of the force and the distance move in the direction of the force okay so uh, work done has the same unit as energy uh, joules and force as the unit of newton and the distance should be in terms of meter okay and as you can see this i put two arrows on top of the force and the distance this is to remind us that the force and the distance must be in the same direction before work is done okay and the last part will be power power is defined as a rate of doing work or the rate of change of energy so the formula will be uh, power is either equal to work over time or the change in energy over time. Power is in terms of what represented by a capital W and uh, work and energy, they have the same unit which is joules and the time must be in terms of second.